everyone, it's Raquel from Succulents Box. Welcome back to our channel. Today let's talk about how to stimulate root growth in succulents. First, a healthy root system is essential for the plant's overall health and survival. A well-developed root system carries essential minerals and water from the roots to the stems and enables the plant to absorb water and nutrients efficiently. This is particularly important for succulents because they store water in their leaves and stems. Secondly, healthy roots help hold the plant in its place, protecting it from harsh environmental conditions. They also keep intact within the soil. If your plants have a bad root system, they are likely to die soon. Moreover, succulents have adapted to grow in arid environments, so they have developed shallow root systems to quickly absorb any available moisture. By encouraging root growth, you're helping your succulent to establish a strong foundation and become more resilient to environmental stresses such as drought. A healthy root system also supports the growth of new leaves, stems, and flowers. Next, I'll share with you some important tips to encourage root growth in succulents. First tip, use well-draining soil and water properly. You know that succulents thrive in soil that allows for good drainage because waterlogged soil is the most common reason for root rot. Any high-quality succulent soil mix would do, or you can mix potting soil with coarse sand and perlite. When watering your succulents, make sure to give them a good soak, but allow the soil to dry out completely before watering again. This encourages the roots to grow and seek out moisture. Second tip, give your succulents plenty of bright light. Succulents love bright light, so place them in a spot that gets plenty of direct or indirect sunlight so they can photosynthesize more efficiently and grow better. Third tip, avoid overpotting. Succulents have shallow root systems, so you should avoid using a pot that is too big or too deep. Huge pots keep nope. water at the bottom and the roots will rot due to too much moisture. Avoid planting multiple succulents in one pot as it can lead to overcrowding and hinder root growth. Nope. Fourth tip, repot when necessary. As your succulent grows, it may outgrow its current pot. When this happens, you'll need to repot in a larger pot with fresh soil. This will provide the roots with more space to grow and access fresh nutrients. Fifth tip, to stimulate root growth and promote a healthy root system, do not over fertilize. While fertilizing your succulents, it's important for their growth. Over fertilization can damage their roots. Use a balanced fertilizer once a month during the growing season and dilute it to half strength. Tip number six, if you propagate from cuttings, you can apply the rooting hormone to the base of the cuttings to encourage root growth. Give the fresh cutting well-draining soil and bright light, but protect them from the direct sunlight and maintain the humidity level around 40%. You should also keep the soil slightly moist but not wet. Now that we're talking about root growth, how about the small roots that grow out from your succulent stem and hang in the air? Should we worry about them and should we remove them? Those tiny roots are called aerial roots and can absorb moisture and nutrients from the air. Aerial roots can come from low light conditions and high humidity. You can move your plant to a brighter, drier location and snip the aerial roots with a trimmer or clippers. Keeping or removing aerial roots will not cause any harm to your succulents. That's it for today's video everyone, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave us a like and consider subscribing for more content. If you've got any questions or recommendations, please leave them in the comment section below. For more, you can find us at succulentsbox.com or on YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest.